Do you need glasses? I got some right here. Fornication. Fornication such as this, I would like to thank you. Let me and together they truly make an unstoppable couple. They are both caring, strong-willed, and intelligent. Their love for one another is apparent to each of us today. The great thing about Rob is, and Kayleen is that they planned for the marriage. As a matter of fact, Rob has already found out that a married man is one who replaces the money in his wallet. With his, <laughs> the money in his wallet with a picture of his wife. <laughs> Rob has always excelled with everything he does whether it's friends, career, RMRU. <laughs> and, or sports, even if you was always the last to be picked. <laughs> Unfortunately, Rob was a slow starter. At preschool, <laughs> at play school, Rob was different from the other five-year-olds. He was 11. <laughs> I know if he models. I know if he models his brother Roger, that he will be a wonderful spouse. And and since Kathy and our 20-year uh, anniversary was Wednesday. Uh, I should give you a little advice. <laughs> well, one thing Kathy and I never do is go to bed angry. We usually just stay up and argue. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, these two people are very important to us. Without them, the night will be a little less joyous. The great thing about this evening, as the evening progresses, most of us will have the opportunity to spend more time talking with them. So please join me in a very special toast, the bar staff. <laughs> If I may finish this with a little poem that sums up marriage quite nicely. The perfect groom is gentle, never harsh, cruel, or mean. He has a beautiful smile and keeps his face so clean. Never harsh, cruel, or mean. Right, the perfect groom likes children and will raise them by his side. Will be a good father and husband to his bride. The perfect groom loves cooking, cleaning, and laundry too. <laughs> will you do any will you do anything in his power to show love for you? The perfect groom is sweet, writing poetry from your name, is a best friend to your mother and kisses away the pain. Never makes you cry or hurt you in any way. And if this poem stands to be true, then Rob May you really are gay. <laughs> Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Raise your glasses to Rob and Kayla. Woo!